With roots in restorative, iTero's versatile scanners are designed to streamline and enhance a range of digital workflows, like full art rehabilitation. Dr. Andrea Anini and Dr. Alessandro Anini will demonstrate just how intuitive the digital workflow for full art rehabilitation with implants can be. This patient came to see doctors Andrea and Alessandro Anini with a failing upper jaw dentition due to chronic periodontal disease. The treatment approach they chose was a full art rehabilitation supported by six implants. Scanning patients with the iTero scanner at the first appointment is quick, comfortable and an excellent way to capture high-definition imagery before beginning treatment. For the full art rehabilitation, the doctors began by creating an eye record prescription to scan the initial failing dentition opposing arch and the bite. While the patient was seated, they collected all the necessary information for proper case analysis and diagnosis, including intraoral scans, CBCT, x-rays, photographs and videos. To clearly communicate the proposed treatment, the doctors used the DSD Smile design tool to simulate the treatment outcome. The iTero Scanner's open system allows for the easy transfer of files to chairside and lab software. So once the doctors captured the scans, they were able to share them, along with the case analysis and diagnosis, directly with their lab to help them with case planning and surgical guide fabrication. After capturing patient images, the doctors coordinated with the lab. Lab technicians then use the DSD files as a foundation for the restorative design. First, they exported the smile simulation files to the prosthetic design software. In this case, the lab used ExoCAD Dental CAD. After the lab superimposed the CBCT files and the ExoCAD restorative treatment plan on ExoPlan software, the doctors were able to determine the best position for the implants to design the surgical guide. With the doctor's approval, a provisional restoration was fabricated prior to the surgery. ExoCAD DentalCAD software is capable of using the implant positions from ExoPlan to design a screw-retained provisional restoration for the implant's immediate loading. Using this, the lab prepared the surgical guide and provisional restoration for the next appointment. Now for surgery. Thanks to the iTero scanner's accurate digital planning and surgical guides, the implants were placed in the optimal position. After surgery, the screw-retained provisional restoration was adapted to the implant's multi-unit abutments and finalized for loading. To ensure successful implant placement, a post-operative X-ray is recommended. Then, the doctors walk through post-op instructions with the patient before the next appointment a few months later. Once the patient was healed, the doctors checked for successful osseointegration and made sure the soft tissue looked healthy and stable. Then, the doctors created a restorative prescription for the implant scanning. They entered all the information pertinent to scan body's type and desired abutments before proceeding with the iTero scanning protocol as follows. Scan of the arch in treatment with provisional in place. Scan of the opposing arch. Scan of the bite. Remove the provisional and screw in the scan bodies. Scan of scan bodies and an HD scan of each scan body. Scan the provisional restoration outside the mouth. Great! Now back to the lab. For the final restoration, the lab fabricated a metal bar for the foundation. They also fabricated a PMMA prototype trial. With the doctor's approval, it was time for the next appointment to be scheduled. Here, the doctors checked to make sure the metal bar had a proper and passive fit. Then, with the PMMA prototype, they ensured a properly balanced occlusion and that the patient was satisfied with the appearance. If any occlusal adjustments are needed, 
doctors can modify the prototype and scan its occlusal part to advise the lab on any necessary modifications. If not, the lab can create the final restoration. the final appointment, the doctors checked with the patient to ensure everything felt right before screwing the restoration onto the implants. In addition to checking for balanced occlusion and the proper function and aesthetics of the restoration, they made sure the implants had an accurate passive fit and the soft tissue wasn't compressed by the restoration. After checking to make sure the patient was satisfied with the results, the full arch rehabilitation with the implants was completed and routine care and monitoring of the patient's well-being were resumed. And that's just one example of how the Itero scanner is a versatile tool designed to help you simplify complex treatments, work seamlessly with your lab, and increase patient satisfaction. Which treatment will you tackle today?